Hey there, Aaron. This is Ocal playing Sonic Pocket Adventure Slight Take Two because of controller issues that have been fixed. So, can I just go here? No, it won't let me continue from where I was last time, though. So, I still need to do some magic. Alright, so, ooh, I wonder if what I. Okay, well, last Utopia, uh, back to Sonic 3 here, that just happened on its own. I mean, yeah, clearly this is gonna be a boss act. I don't know, uh, you got the M gem thing, diamond thing. Lost Utopia is an amazing name, I have to say, just by the way. Alright, so just, okay, so somehow I'm not gonna survive. Okay, so there, uh, like if he's, oh, jeez. Don't, that's gross, kind of, I don't like that amount of violence. So you, like, you bop him, then you gotta fly all the way, then you get, that happens. None of this is great. Okay, what happened? Boo <laughs> diddy doo diddy doo. <laughs> that is the exchange we've had, Robotnik and I. And if I continue, yeah, now I can go to Last Utopia. All right, still an awesome name. Still an awesome name. Like, who comes up with the name of the level? Is it Sonic when he gets there? Is it Christen by Robotnik when he arrives here? Uh, you don't, like, I think it's been established that hedgehogs can breathe in space no problem, but Robotnik, you are but a human also. Also, I'm not sure how to get out of the hurt zone there. Like, you gotta bounce like that, I guess, and then, oh, he's rotating. Alright, he's got several moves. I, I can cheese it by just getting the same ring over and over again. Whoa, rocket punch! Destroy the ship! That was an ugly fight on my end. But it's not done. He's running away! Oh, it fell in space! <laughs> oh, that counts as a death. That's pretty funny. <laughs> Alright. Ah, uh, funny. So you got to go at it at an angle. There, uh, I, I couldn't, my, I don't know, man. I, I have lost control over myself. It happens. And then you just kind of vaguely raise your arm, <laughs> and that bops me. That's how it goes. <laughs> I mean, remove remove the risk factor because this like this would be very frustrating. Ugh, but because yeah, like a big part of the risk factor part has been excised by removing consequences. Ah, it gets fun again. Like, I'd rather it be fun and a bit unconsequential than too frustrating. And look at that man's face there. That's a man, oh shoot, who's finally doing something he's always wanted to do. And I'm dead. I, I, it's, it's a bounce back after the hit. Uh, that seems to be the hardest part. Because you go in, you do your damage. But I gotta land somewhere, I'm not gonna get bopped. Oh no, I'm afraid. I'm Sonic. I can sniff my ankles. That's weird. The proportions are amazing, Sonic. Alright, so... Whatever, man. Okay, so that's his dash and grab attack. See, by act... Oh, can you land on a diamond behind him? Oh! Okay, alright. I might have found the trick. You land on the back there, and it was kind of awkward looking. Yeah, okay, but, oh, you can bounce once, and then I blew him up. <laughs> Still an ugly fight. Uh, looking back behind him, even if there's no one there. Robotnik is smart. All right, so I'm not... Okay, maybe now I'm supposed... Oh, look at that, he's afraid. He was pleading for his life, and now he's a tomato! Sonic got through finals! Somewhat. Somehow. <laughs> that wasn't very pretty. Oh, shoot, now the earth exploding. Yeah, that's gonna happen if you're not careful, Sonic. <laughs> oh, jeez, we got ourselves, like, some freaking, like, uh, comic book art here. Yeah! Like, that's just that classic thing where, you oh, that looked actually pretty rad. This, this all looks pretty rad, like, honestly speaking. This is the game the Game Gear game wanted to be. Uh, and I feel like they could've, if they, like, look how simple the graphics are. Like, the Game Gear could recreate 
the style. And I feel like it would have been a lot better than trying to force 16-bit art in an 8-bit system. This game is really fun. Like, it's really well made. I, I feel like the difficulty just kind of slams against the floor at the last minute in a kind of weird way. Maybe they realized the early game was too easy? I don't know, because it is pretty easy. And then whammo slammo. Uh, tomorrow's gonna be a busy day for me, because I'm basically gonna try to reach and complete. Hi, uh, Sound Chief! Uh, I'm gonna try and complete all five special zones. I don't know how long it's gonna be. Might take me a while. Uh, I mean, debug, it has debug team. That's pretty good. The manual making does not have a manual team. Landsat, <laughs> here to go. Yeah, SNK development. Yeah, this is before, before Dimps. This is, I know, at some point there's gonna be people that are gonna get out of uh, SNK and form their own studio, Dimps. And Dimps is gonna have a close relationship with the Sonic franchise, uh, eventually. And this is sort of like the first date, so to speak. Hey, well, thanks for your making. Like I said, this game is pretty fun, but... <laughs> Sassy Robotnik making fun of me. Well, you all gonna make fun of me that long, cause like I said, I'm gonna get those gems, and then we're gonna see what happens. That's a giant ring! There's a hedgehog that lives in it with giant hands! 